Hello, my name is George Salcedo. I work for Ruder Hero Plumbing, and in today's task, we're going to go over installing a garbage disposal. The tools you're going to need to install a garbage disposal, plumber's putty, and a four-in-one screwdriver. Um, the first thing in installing the garbage disposal and what you're going to get out of the box, disposal, your strainer. In some boxes, you'll get your own pigtail. If it's not hardwired, you have to get this. If, if it's hardwired, you're going to use the electrical coming out of the wall. And you'll also get your 90 here with a gasket that will go on this end right here. First step is you want to install your strainer. And what you need to do is you grab your, your screwdriver. There's three screws here, just like a regular kitchen strainer. And you unscrew these. Once that's loose, there's a ring inside of here. And if you use your screwdriver and you clip it up, that ring should come right out just like that. Once that's out, you can pull this piece out and this piece out. This here, you don't need it. You can just dispose of it because we're going to put a uh, plumber's putty here. Once this is ready, go ahead and set it on, set it in the sink, push down on it. Let your plumber's putty spread all around as much as you can. Once that's on there, uh, the order is this piece first. It's going to go inside. You want the flat side going up this way, not upside down. After you get that in there, you're going to put this piece just like this, upside down, not this way. That's Once that's in, you put your ring back on there. Once you put your ring and it's locked, you, you can get ready to screw these on there. Okay, so now that we got our strainer uh, installed. You want to grab your garbage disposal and if it's not already hardwired and you got your pigtail, start off by installing your pigtail. And the way you do that is you got a little cover plate here and if you loosen that up just a little, it should come right off. First you want to unscrew this. Pull this as far as back as you can. Once that's through there, you can grab these like that. Grab your wire nut. Put one on there. Once you got the black and white on there, grab your, your ground. And your ground is going to go on this green screw here. What you do is you completely take the screw out. Once it's all out, slide it in here and screw it back on there. And once that's tied, you can cover this back up. And that's how you put a pigtail. And while I have this upside down, this is your reset button. If it ever pops the, the, the breaker inside the disposal, this is how you pop it back on. And if it ever gets jammed, the garbage disposal comes with this Allen key here. What you can do is you stick it in there and you turn it until it unjams. Once you got that in there, you have these two holes here with this. You put your washer, your gasket, I'm sorry, there. Got this piece here, slide it on there. You got two screws, that goes on there, and your screws go on here. Nice and 
industry. Also, um, in this example, we don't have a, a dishwasher. If we did, there's a little plastic plug in here. And what you do is with a screwdriver, you can stick it in there and you can pop it out. Pull the piece out and there's a, your, dispose, your um, dishwasher will have a hose and that will connect here and then to the, to the, uh, to the air gap. So in this situation, we don't have a, a dishwasher, so we're gonna go ahead and leave that in there. It's very important that you do leave that blocked if you do not have a dishwasher, otherwise the water's gonna pour out and you're gonna get a recall. So make sure that stays in there if you don't need it. Okay, now we're gonna go over installing your disposal to your disposal strainer. And it's really simple. It's just gonna lock into place like that. You go up, turn, and make sure it locks. So up, turn. Once it's locked, you can move it to wherever you need to move it depending on the way your plumbing is set up. So in this situation, I wanna put it this way because I'm gonna put a two-part waste here and connect to the peat trap that we're gonna install here. And that's how you install a garbage disposal.